All right, today we're taking a look at micro workouts for the legs. And when it comes to leg training, this is one of those things that gets bloated really fast, not because there's so many exercises, but because there's so much rest time in between exercises. Because really when we get down to it, your leg training only has one or two major moves. You got squat variations and lunges. And even then I would say lunges are a squat variation because it's the same basic movement pattern for your legs. So this is one of my favorite squat and lunge combinations for a very fast workout that's gonna smoke your legs. So the basic premise of this workout is that you're gonna have two stations on each side of either a room or a space, whatever. And at each of those stations, you have a squat variation and you do lunges in between the two. So let me give you kind of an example of how this works. Today we're gonna be doing lunges and squats with a sandbag. But I am a big fan of using weight that you carry to the front of your body for the balance aspect. So we have our sandbag squats and just for the sake today, we're gonna get good 10 deep squats, keeping tension in the hips. And I'm talking to you, so I'm totally not even counting. But either way, once you get your squats, then you head straight into your lunges. So as we're getting our lunges in, we want to make sure that we're driving as much weight onto our front leg as possible. It's not this 90 degree stuff where the shin is forward, or the shin is vertical rather, and the weight is equally distributed between your two legs. Instead, get as much weight onto that front leg as you can to make the leg work as hard as possible. The best way I think about it is ass to ankle. Get that as close to one or the other. It'll improve your mobility in your hip and your ankle and make your legs work so much harder than if you did a standard 50-50 lunge. Coming down with our standard lunges, all the way down, hips low as possible. And then once you get to the end of your route, you have another set of your squats. Keeping yourself upright, whether you're using weight or body weight. And you can, of course, use close squats, pistol squats, whatever squat variation of your choice. And then once you're done here, you go right back into the lunges yet again. There are many ways that you can be doing this exercise. You can do 10 repetition squats, lunge, 10, lunge, and then 10 at the origin and count that. Or if you wanna get a little bit more volume or up for a bit of a cardio challenge, you can do descending reps. So it's 10, lunge, eight, six, four, and two. And that's going to only take several minutes, but it's gonna make your legs work significantly harder than if you did it the other way and you'd have much more volume. I'll have more thoughts and ideas down below in the description section of the video. So if you need more details or if you have questions, leave them down below as always. Check out the micro workouts playlist and other information here as well. Be fit, live free.